Hi everyone, uh, today we will be learning how to do edit link from a different workbook. So edit link is uh, used if you want to update links in your file from a different file. For example, uh, let's take, uh, let's see these three columns here, column B, C and D. Column B has uh, a department which is uh, basis the employee code which is appearing in column A. So this is a formula which uh, derives the department from another file. Similarly, uh, this is the job role of that person which is also uh, derived from that similar file. This file is for October 20 and uh, the third is the salary which is derived from another file which is the HR file of October 20. So uh, all these files are from October 20. We need to update the files uh, for the month of November. So how can we do that without applying these formulas again is I will uh, tell you in this uh, video. So first I would like to inform you two important things. Uh, the old file and the new file which we are using should be identical and there should be similar columns in both the files. So if there is a col column movement, if there is different column uh, in between, number of columns are not the same. So it might result in a different uh, result, which is which is not accurate. So the files should be identical first. Second thing is edit link. It cannot be reversed using Control Z. So if you do a Control Z, Control Z, uh, it will not undo what you have already done. So you just need to close the workbook and open it again. You will lose all the changes that you have made, right? So we'll start, uh, I'll tell you how to do it. So uh, first we need to go to data. So data here in the ribbon, go to edit links. Once you click on edit links, there will be this window which pops up. So there are two files which are linked here. One, one is the department list. The other one is the HR file. So uh, I will click on department list first. We will update the October file from November file. So we'll click on change source and this window, window will pop up. This window you need to find where the new file is saved. So uh, it'll here it will show you the name of the file that you are looking for. Department list October we need to find department list November. So I have saved this in the department list folder and I'll click on department list November and I'll click OK. So once I click OK, you see these cells will change and it has the updated value. Similarly, we'll do it for HR file. We'll click on HR file. We'll do a change source and we will find the HR list and click on November and click OK. So it will update the salary details and now we'll close this. If you see, there are changes which have been made. So changes have now been updated. If you see the formula here, it says November department list it says November here and in the HR file also it says November so your formulas are updated and uh, good to go now so if you like the video please uh, click on the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you